Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm so happy that we are together again and I have some interesting information to share with you all and please forgive my analog versus, versus digital um, presentation but I wanted to share this with you. It has to do with Hurricane Irma and that the ocean has disappeared. I have a little video to show you and I'm not going to um, add anything on to the end. I'll let it speak for itself but I just want you to remember that we're not alone. God sent us Jesus to remind us of his love for us and that Jesus is ultimate sacrifice so we can all be together with God in heaven and I pray that you all will keep that in mind and keep looking up and keep seeking God's face and and asking Jesus into your life and the Holy Ghost into your soul and 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 be blessed because we don't know what tomorrow will bring um, so let's get started okay as this article from the Huffington Post um, HuffPost.com says the Hurricane Irma sucked the ocean away from Florida and the Bahamas, Bahama beaches. And the people that were there actually recorded and saw the water recede and um, they were able to walk around and it's all in video. Uh, it's it's amazing, and if you don't live on a coastal area or have never heard of this phenomenon, it's almost unheard of. Where does the water go? You know, where did the water go? Um, and if uh, we read a little farther down, in the Bahamas is actually reported um, that the water did come back. So it and it came up. It came back in higher levels than it was before, um, but in Florida, as reported, it has not come back yet. So the water returned in, to the Bahamas, but we're still waiting for the water to return on the Florida coastline. And um, just like that vision insight that the Lord showed me of, of him holding back the water and I could see those oil drums, um, it is exactly what, what we're seeing in Florida. The water's being held back. Um, so I pray for all those people. I even have uh, my best friend lives out there. So we pray for all of them, family and friends and even strangers we don't know. We pray for them because we don't know. It might just come back and just be fine. Um, but we have to keep in prayer, in faith, standing strong. Okay, um, I'm going to play this video for you all. May all God bless you all and keep you. I love you and Jesus loves you. Please take this up to the Lord and discernment. But, uh, we have to also see the signs that he puts out in front of us and know the times that we're living in. Take care. God bless. Next one. 